A group of disabled people in Collier County is learning confidence and boating at the same time. They are part of a program called SHARE, or Society for Handicapped Achievement, Rehabilitation and Empowerment. As health reporter Abigail Black explains, the sailing program helps people who have different disabilities and different goals. Robin has multiple sclerosis, and while she may have a bit of trouble on land, once on the water, it's smooth sailing. See a key Leg amputee Tony DiNicola also traded in his crutches for a sailboat sheath. I never thought I'd be in a sailboat. Robin and Tony are just two of the success stories. There are about 35 others, handicapped people for whom share sailing has changed their life. It empowers me and gets me on my own. But sailing isn't only helping to overcome a physical challenge. If you let it, a disability can handicap the mind just as much as the body. There are some people in our program that say that they only get out of bed in the morning because they know that on Sunday and Tuesday we're going to be out here and they're going to be able to just get away from their problems and be free. For these boaters, being on the water is another chance at the life they once knew. When you're out there on 5th Avenue South, yeah, you're, you're definitely labeled, you're in the chair, or I have these hooks. When these people are out in the boats, often uh, people come because they see us out on the water, they have no idea that these guys are disabled. And while today it might just be Naples Bay, tomorrow it could be anywhere or anything. For Eye on Your Health, I'm Abigail Bleck, Wink News. Positive attitude. Two weeks ago, one of the men featured in the story, Tony DiNicola, skippered a boat that placed first in a Miami regatta. Tony had never been sailing until after he had his leg amputated.